From sunrise to sunset, drivers have a huge advantage in the sun. Although it's easy to take for granted, the sun makes it immensely easier for us to see. Once darkness falls, driving becomes a whole new ball game. There's no doubt about it. Driving is a lot dicier after the sun goes down. Driving at night does present a whole new set of circumstances for um, any driver, young driver or an older driver. Darkness itself is a hazard. Even people with the best of vision cannot see as well at night. To begin with, your field of vision is less. You actually see a smaller amount of space. Objects are not as sharp, you can't perceive dips and rises as well, and you have a harder time distinguishing colors. A person with excellent vision still needs to remember to slow down and be aware of all the hazards that could present itself at night. You can only see as far ahead as your headlights shine. That makes it harder to see pedestrians, cyclists, animals, obstacles in the road. So go slowly enough so that you can stop within the distance lighted by your headlights. If it's safe, use your high beams, especially on open highways. But always know when to change to low beams. If you approach another car from behind, or if you meet an oncoming car, then switch to low beams. High beams blind other drivers and increase the likelihood of a crash. To avoid being blinded, don't look directly at oncoming headlights. Instead, look to the right edge of your lane and watch the oncoming car out of the corner of your eye. A couple of other brief points. Never drive with just your parking lights on. Parking lights are designed for parking. They're not a substitute for headlights. And keep your windshield and your headlights clean. They can get real dirty real quick. It's easy enough to do. I give them a quick wipe when I'm at the gas station. It helps reduce glare, it helps the lights to shine brighter, and in general, it helps you to see much better at night. This is Jim Angelo.